Well, this is Tom G. Airport, and I'm doing an airport update number six, seven, or eight, I don't know. And uh, there are a lot of changes to my airport. I have shifted it to this corner. It used to be this corner over here, but anyway, and you are thinking what's well, you already know what's changed to my airport is that I've got another runway, and I've got some runway stands. And you can see there's some planes parked there. Such as my Air, Air 2000 Turkish Airlines and Valoris. Uh, and yep, yeah, uh, Air 2000 will be going to Mallorca in a moment's time. Turkish will be going up to Istanbul or Turk, and Valoris and Miami will just stay in those places. And on the taxiway going up to runway 18 left is Air 757 uh, 300. Um, yeah, and uh, I still get my regional um, terminal where it is, and there's the uh, ATR and uh, 77. And my newest planes, which is a uh, descent, which is taking off, climbing out of runway 08R, so Hawaiian Airlines 767300 WL, which stands for winglets. Does it? Yeah, yeah, WL stands for winglets. Uh, and yeah, there's a uh, Finnair MD-11 and Virgin Atlantic AT-40 on top of the terminal, just to say. But Finnair don't go to this airport yet, they soon will. Uh, my Dash 8 hasn't arrived yet. Anyway, but here's um, my here's the ATR going off to uh, Edinburgh soon. Uh, then 737-400BA, which is going to be going off to Innsbruck in Austria. The Virgin 7474Q8, which is boarding passengers and is going off to Los Angeles. And next to that is the Super Jumbo, the A380 Singapore, which is going to Sydney via Hong Kong in, in around about an hour's time. And then there's another Super Jumbo, Qantas, going to Z Sydney via Melbourne. Uh, which is there, parked right next to an, the Singapore A380. And yeah, we also have big uh, wide-body wide gates at the remote stands. And these are all narrow-body. We've got four. No, we've got one, two, three, four, five narrow-body gates and two big body uh, wide-body gates. Um, yeah, we have put uh, some more markings on these taxiways, like runway ahead, like hold short stuff. And we have to put a road across that. Which is a bit dangerous though, but you know, we should be in the world's dangerous airports. If it was a real airport. Um, and the, uh, on my hangar, that used to be, first choice, is now turned to be a city flyer terminal. And it's also being used by FedEx and UPS, as we have changed the logos on the side, because I accidentally ripped them the logos off. And of course there is FedEx and UPS at the cargo bay right there. And I've drawn a cargo thingy where the cargo cars park, right just in front, there. And of course Swiss International Airlines which is going off to uh, San Francisco. And it did came in from uh, Geneva uh, like this morning. You know, it came into Geneva like an hour ago, or just like two hours ago. And yeah, it's going off to, uh, to um, yeah, San Francisco. Uh, as for Hawaii, it's going off to Honolulu. And Virgin, I have got, uh, you probably haven't seen this Virgin Atlantic in any of my videos. This is one I had for ages and I did break it, but it is prepared by Camp 3242. Here's the Gemini camera. Jets 3242. Yeah, Gemini Jets 3242, who is doing the camera. This Hello. Way. And, yeah, of course, yeah, there I'll it is. I'll take through some aspects. Sorry to interrupt you there. Uh, that's alright. Uh, we sorry. have repaired the nose wheel with, there's a nail. I know it seems weird, but there's a nail being holding it on just there. I'll tip this over. Yeah, he's very good at repairing stuff. Yep. Uh, we did. Unfortunately, we did have some landing gear here, though. On the way, it kind of fell off. I don't actually. I don't know when it fell off, but and I've lost them. But uh, that's done. There's a nail, super glue there. Um. In the back, we have added some new elevators, and the tail's been fixed on with some super glue. As you can see, they're not proper 747 elevators. No, we kind of had to nick them from what was it? The Cathay Pacific A340. Cathay Pacific A340. 40, 40, 600. Which is in 1 to 500 scale. 
which is in my bedroom and broken. Yes. And then on the back it has, oh, on the back it, it does tip over, it has back in the bed London 2012 on the back. I know John P3922's got this model and it is rare. Apparently. Is, yeah, apparently. Uh, I, I believe it. That is. Well, no, it's not very good, you rare and you've broken it. But never mind. Moving swiftly. Yeah. And uh, there's the Virgin Atlantic hanger, folded by, well, Virgin Atlantic at the moment. And opposite, across the apron, is a Mexico Triple Seven holding the BA City Flyer um, hanger. Which we are going to put BA City Flyer one time or another because it's the hanger. Uh, you did do the thinner, didn't you? And the yeah. Virgin, yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, it looks a bit crammed at the moment because we got our Rigel Majors boxes there. And um, oh, sorry. And I'm soon to be putting on fake grass, but I've got the wrong kind of models in. It's the powdery stuff, but I will soon. My mum has filmed models in. Just now, actually. Yeah, just now. And uh, said about it. Uh, yeah, and we're gonna get the roll that you just stick on. Like yeah. I've got. I will be doing that when I get my airport guys. Um. Yeah. Cam's already got his. He's. Yeah. I've been in London. Yeah, you went to models in London. But it's great. It's good that they. Not got just to get the grass. I went on a trip. Yeah. <laughs> I I wouldn't go all that way to get some grass. Yeah. Um, yeah, so it's the whole airport. I'm actually kind of, I'm really pleased I got a second runway. I have drawn the sterile area where the arrows follow up and there's the threshold lights and then there's Quite the hard to see. Yeah, and that's also a threshold for that's also yeah. sterile area for that. Um, to that runway. Yeah, um it's getting pretty busier. We rather we've done more gates. We have Actually, printed these off a good website. Can I what the it's, website's called? Uh, well, we'll link in the description. It's called Sam's D90 Airport Foils. Type that in Google, it should come up. Although, we'll have a link in the description for them. And then you can just print it out and then you can stick it anywhere on your airport. Like I've got an arrow for um, five and arrow body gates. Here we've used PVA glue and sellotape to stick them iron, down. Yeah, iron over the gaps as if you're as they will rip. If you're probably what if you're sorry, sorry to interrupt. Sorry. Right. Um, the why we forgot to yeah, that, that that did kind of forget to cut off. Do you but have a grey pen? Grey pen. Yeah. I do have a. Mm -hmm. it should it should be. But anyway, yeah. Uh, we'll do that in a minute, won't we? So yeah. And the total gates now. The amount 21. of gates is twenty one. Twenty one gates. Um, Sorry guys, I was just a bit okay. We have 21 gates in total, and how many planes do we have? Um, Why are you still on a chair? No, <coughs> it's just like to see it better. Um, how many planes have we got in total? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, see the boxes 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. 19 it, planes with 20? It Probably. 19. 19 planes with 21 slots. But, but I might have got that wrong, but I... Well, that's just a rough estimate. That's yeah, a rough estimate if it was 19. Yeah. So, yeah, um... Yeah, also, yeah, I have drawn some gates in uh, the regional area. I've mentioned that before in my last video of the Hawaiian Airlines. Um, I really want to find out when my Dash 8 400 is going to get here. I think I got lost in the post. Pardon? I reckon it's got lost in the post. Probably. Yeah. It does turn up, it just takes quite a while. Yeah, probably. It'll turn up sooner or later. And if it, when it does, so we'll put it where the ATR is parked. No, 737. Yeah. And 737 will go over where the extended area is. Yeah. Yeah, we could put the. Yeah, there as well, can we? Yeah. Oh. Anyway, we could put it in any gate, really. You can either put it in the. In a remote stand. You could go to a large gate for now. Or well, 757 could go in a large gate, and then 757 goes where the 75 is. Yeah, yeah, that's very good. That's very good, actually. Yeah, so um, uh, this is my airport update. Well, yeah, airport update. Sorry, what? Um, the I, yeah, I've boxes in the car park. Yeah, we a put world out, first. Yeah. Nowhere else in the world have they put gigantic boxes of model planes in a car park. Yeah, I've got my Virgin Atlantic card at the top where I got my 
um, my new model, which is the uh, one in the uh, larger livery, I think I do believe is in the hangar. Um, it is a limited edition, and it's got Sir Richard Branson's signature, which is quite good actually. Um, oh, guys, and I forgot to say that my Hawaiian Airlines is official pro licensed product of Boeing. I forgot to say that in my. No, you didn't. Oh, did I? Uh, no. I think you probably did. Anyway, I, I, uh, oh yeah, okay. Um, but this is. Oh, don't. Oh, sorry, I'm not. Um, so yeah, this is. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. This is Tom GJ Airport signing out. And please comment, rate, and subscribe. Bye.